Zebra Herd, welcome back to Bowser Jr.'s Journey. In the last episode, we made our way through, of course, the lava lair, trying to find the missing remains of the castle, or at least rummage through them, and get to the basement and find the Everest, and we were able to do it. So now, we're moving on to the next area where we need a friend to help us figure out how to make the skeleton formula. So, we got Blubba Lake over here, and it looks like it's a familiar face if you've seen our Bowser Jr., or Bowser's Inside Story playthrough. But yeah, we're at Bubble Lake, and also, I know that now Kamek can actually be a um, first line of defense, whatever it's called, first command or something like that. Um, but first off, let's take a look at this. We got four new enemies here. We got Pokey, who has Whomping Wallop, just like the uh, Goomba Tower. They may have moved slowly, but their HP is a point of pride. They have protective spikes on their bodies, but are weak against boomerang attacks. Again, which we haven't had a boomerang enemy or ally or whatever. And then also we have the horned ant trooper, silent soldiers who keep their cool while cornering enemies. They look, they like to catch foes off guard with their powerful attacks. And then we got you, you are a, wait, hold on, there we go, Lakitu King. A rare Lakitu that wears a crown, rumored to act especially self-important against spinies, so no spinies. And then finally we got Bee Hoss, uh, who has piercing projectile. They tend to release a great many bees. Their piercing projectiles are strong, but they're weak against fire attacks, so I think we want the Prana Plant. I wish we had Larry, I'm really messing them right now. So let's figure out our squad formation a little bit here because I don't think this is gonna work for us. So with all of that going on, it looks like there's a lot of melee, a little bit of flying, and a little bit of ranged. It is overall well mixed, but seeing how it starts always every time with flying out in front, I'm thinking we should follow up with the same. I do want to see what is Kamek's uh, thing. Power uh, scheming, power 10% and de defense 10%. That's actually really good. Because what is defense for, th okay. Hmm. And who are the, the leaders every time? We got a a power, a range, and a power. And a power, what do I say? Melee range and melee. So I want to keep uh, Bowser Jr. as melee because that way he can't have a weakness against the enemy at any specific time. He only has a strength against them on battle number two, but that's fine. So I think what we'll do then is maybe even, I think we'll keep with that. We'll try Kamek as our first line of defense this time, see how things end up working with that. So where's Kamek? He's gonna be a tippity, tippity top of this. So once again, in the front we need, what's it called? We need flying. So we might wanna do like, something like this, like that would be pretty cool, right? And then maybe one more, like a Koopa. Okay, so this is where things get a little scary. Cause I think I want, cause I have three more things left. If I could get Morton and put him here and then get two flying, that might be worth my while. Not flying, ranged. So I wanna make sure those guys are matching that. I wanna make it this and then that. And that seems pretty good to me. And that's the tank formation, so power 5%. It's actually actually not too bad. We'll try it. That means we have a 15% power up and 10% defense. That seems really good to me. So with that, that being set up, I don't think I have too many beans to work with. Actually, no, I have plenty. Flying beans, what do I wanna do with this? I mean, I could try to get Kami closer to a level up. Is any of these guys close to a level up? Not really, so I'll just inch Kamek ever so closer. We got the range experience bean, which really, once again, could get you a little bit closer. Oh, that worked! Oh, that was a medium, nice! It actually did get the level up. And then we have a super experience bean grant three, regardless of the type. Okay, um, nobody here is less than 30 close to it. This guy's super close to it, but I feel like I gotta start using it for characters that are really far away from the level up, so that this helps them get there quicker. So we got that, and then we got a defense drumstick, which gives plus one defense to Bowser Jr. Might as well, right? And what else are we gonna do with that? So let's get into the action, wrong button, into the action. It doesn't seem like there's too much going on in this world, so this might be another shorter episode. I say shorter, but these episodes are always like 40 minutes at the minimum. Stay focused. Let's get to it. Formation tank. This is looking pretty cool. So battle number one, we got a lot of these horned ants. Okay. Got it. Got it, got it, no, oh, wait, that was only great, darn. That would've been good if I could've gotten that. Okay, they're doing it again, no, okay, one of them got denied, that's actually not that big of a deal, we still get the combo, which is what matters the most. Okay, look at that, that was amazing. Enemy defense down as well, ooh, I love the swoops, they're great. 
Come on, everybody, keep fighting. Keep fighting. We're nine to, nine to five now. We might actually be able to, uh, I was hoping maybe we could get this done without losing anybody. Keep going, everybody. Oh, not quite, not quite. Deny that. We're gonna get two points restored, so we might as well just deny what we can, what we can. Yikes, that stinks, but it could have been worse. It's seven to two. Chances are looking really high we're gonna get the win here. Come on, Suits, finish this ant off. He has a lot of health, but once again, it's not that big of a deal. Woo hoo hoo. All right, so enemy defense down. And oh, look at Morton, he's doing good. And that is gonna be that guy taken out. Even if it damages Morton a little bit, everybody gets healed up between the battles. So two more left to go. I definitely feel like we're handling this game a lot better than Bowser's minions, which has me happy. Cause that one was just so tough for me for some reason. So we're gonna definitely deny that one, to deny two of them, so it's not a combo move anymore, which really makes it easier to handle. What did you get, a golden hammer? Oh, that's really cool, I want a golden hammer. Oh well, oh, don't deny that. So these Lakitus are definitely giving us a hard time. I say that, but nobody's gotten taken out yet. You get the mystery box. Hmm. They get some heals. Ooh, that's actually pretty bad. I denied two of them again, so that's all I'm gonna do for this round if I can manage it. Oh, a stick. Okay, the stick is probably the, the least harmful thing out of that set. Looks like it, at least. I don't know why Morn's continually trying to attack. Oh, here we go. Flying units right now. Okay, we got the excellent stuff is flying everywhere. Not quite a takedown for anybody, but this might actually be. Dang it, if I didn't mess it up, I'm the worst. But the defense is down, so now's our chance to really make things work. We haven't lost any units yet, somehow. Why'd I do that? I shouldn't have done that one. It would have been fine. It's, okay, seven to three here. Ooh, I don't know if I wanna see that one. Oh, bees everywhere, beating up Bowser Jr. a little bit too. Now it's five to three. Things are getting a little nastier here. Come on, come on. Four to three, four to two. Keep beating this thing up, but beat up the Lakitu first so we can get some bonus experience. Come on, come on. So it looks like right now Kamek doesn't actually have an ability, which sort of stinks. Okay, well, I was hoping for the bonus experience, but if the game doesn't want to give it to me, what am I supposed to do? Okay, everybody, come back in. We have almost full set of CP, so we'll be able to do rally and then two uh, denies. I hope we get more CP soon. If we can level up that does that, that'd be great. Okay, keep moving. Everybody seems to be doing well. Got it, got it. So there's that guy down, and then here we go. Let's not mess. Oh, we have already messed it up. That's fine, we still did a lot of good damage there. It's nine to eight, and that might change very soon. There we go, it's nine to six. Ooh, this is beautiful. I don't think I want to deny that one. It's just beating up Morton a little bit. So it's eight to three. We have two denies left over, even if you guys rally, as long as it's not the combo, which is what I'm mostly protective against. Oh, the Conan reinforcements, which is sort of a big deal. Uh oh, oh no, not a mushroom. It heals up that guy, it actually didn't heal him up too much. Come on now, we're still in the lead though. I wanna keep it that way. Morton had to hurt his bum there to take care of that guy, which is a shame. And now it's six to two. Come on, come on, nice. Now we just got this dude, come on. It's five of us and one of him. You gotta think we'll be able to win. Perfect, okay, very cool. So that's everything, right? Yep, cleared. All right, I'm happy with that one. So, a decent amount of experience. Uh, Bowser Jr. I wanted to level up more. Oh, we get sneak attack for Kamek. Okay, a skill that only Kamek Blue can use. Is there a red Kamek? Or a different color? I don't know, usually when it's blue, there's usually red with it or something. Or green, you know? I don't know. Uh, stealthily appear behind the enemy captain for a sneak attack, nice. If Kamek is discovered before attacking, his power will decrease. Rumor has it he's more easily detected by troop types than he that he's weak against. So, ooh, we wanna make sure we're doing it against melee and maybe not against ranged. Interesting, well, I wanted to read that. I mean, I guess we've already read these. We get a ant and then we get a pokey. Pretty gosh darn good. Use beans to fortify 50 times, that's good. So it gets some more beans, that's always good to see. And we can already move on to the next battle. Two of them available. So we want to do this one because it's the level 16 one before the level 17 one. So this one is the Borp Bullet Blitz. And nothing entirely new here. Make sure not to use Parabitty Buds, but also maybe use something that spits out fire. And then also, well maybe, okay, it should be fine. And then maybe some Fly Guys. So that should be fine. Okay, yeah, this actually should be a pretty simple one, I think. Uh, so let's go ahead and figure out our formation a little bit. 
Um, take a look at what they got. So it's going to be flying in the front, but only twice. Wow, so much ranged. Um, so I think for the time being, what might actually be smart, because the flying ones, hmm, these guys might be a little under leveled is the problem. So hopefully this helps to some extent. And then, what do we wanna do? Beyond that, I think we need a lot of flying for sure. So Kamek is gonna help me out back this way. Where are you, buddy? We're not, not, did I say flying? I, I meant melee, yeah, sorry. Um, see, I want more out here, maybe actually out in front, something like that. And then Kamek, get him. But then let's just do a ton of really powerful melee. I could do something like this and then basically do the same thing with these guys. Then we have two slots left. I could put them here and, ooh. I mean, there's no combos going on here yet. So let me just go ahead and get another Goomba. And I think that, well, let me double check. What is the captain? Every time the captain is uh, arranged. So I think melee would be good. All right, I actually think this won't be so bad. We'll try it, we'll confirm this, we'll check out our items. We do have speed beans, which I will probably, who has lower speed, Kamek or Morton? Morton does. So there we go, H, uh, melee experience bean M would be great on Morton, because it gives 100 experience. Ooh, let's do that. Very good, ooh, ooh, level up to level 17, and then HP bean, of course Morton's gonna have more HP, so we'll do that for you. Looking good to me. Not really too much more we can do, so let's get to it. Unless there's like more levels that open up later on that we just can't see right now, this seems like it's gonna be a shorter episode for sure. Stay focused. All right, pretty good, pretty good. So everybody's charging in. There's a lot of those little bugs or what of the flowers right over there on the back. Are you guys rallying right away? You are, so I'm gonna rally right away as well. Maybe not the best idea, I don't know, we'll find out. Come on, get fired up. Because we sort of need the Prana Plants to do a bunch of stuff here. Cool. But if Morton can do some early damage to him, that's fantastic. Once we get the flying guys out of the way, it's really not th that big of a deal at all. Mystery box. Oh boy, they get melee damage. Oh, that's actually really bad because that's really lucky of them to get. I gotta be honest. Oh, that hurt, that's for sure. But once we get rid of the flying, it's all advantages for us, basically. It really is looking like it right now, too. Um, keep going, guys, keep going. Nice. There goes that guy. Now he's gotta beat up this one. It's six to one. You better bet, okay, five to one. Sorry, Morton. There it is, we get that bonus experience, which is always good to see. We have that sneak attack as well, which honestly might not really come into play all that much because, you know, has a higher chance of being found out against a melee troop. Okay, they're gonna rally. We're also gonna rally, since it's only two. It shouldn't be that big of a deal. It's only two, right? I think so. So there's that. We're all rallied up. Everybody go. Wait, what's happening? Oh, is he denying that? Stop and drop. Yikes. Deny plus damage. Okay, Morton, get at it. No, don't deny that one too. Stop and dropping it. Really? Okay, now these guys are going again. That was only okay. That stinks. Could have been better. What are you doing now? Mystery box? How many? How much CP do you have? Jeez Louise. 30%, basically back up the full. I guess I'll deny that, what else am I gonna do? Okay, we might as well try the sneak attack then. Yikes, okay, that was critical, which is not good to see. Uh, call for backup, no. Oh, this is sort of scary, it's eight to four still, but I don't know, it doesn't feel like it. It feels like we have way less troops than that. More enemies, young master, allow me to do some dirty work. Come on, don't be found out. No, was he found out? I guess not, cool. So that's some early extra damage. Deny that. I denied one, so it's just not a combo move, which is good. Yikes, seven to three, six to three, so we still have the lead here. Can we finish them off before uh, before the captain? I guess not. Wait, that was that the, yeah, that was the captain. For a second, I just sort of waited for a moment. So there we go, we win. Not bad at all, that was a really easy one. I'm glad we grinded up a little bit last episode, because it seemed to be worth our time. Okay, so a little bit more level ups for everybody, except for Bowser Jr., again. Um, so we got another Ice Bro, we got another Ice Bro, and we get another Fly Guy. Recruit 20 ranged troopers, it's gonna be another Speed Bean and a Pow Bean. 
Good to see, good to see. So with that done, we're gonna move up here where we have, I mean, I can't move to her just yet. So Bubble Lake uh, laughing loudly. And as we can see, there is, oh, this guy, interesting. This is Crawful, a creature with a strange, boisterous laugh. The power of its body strike is nothing to giggle at. Mm. And then we have a Red Koopa. Remember to know Perry Bitty Bud's weakness. We know Perry Bitty Bud. Um, Red Paratroopa doesn't really do too much. Wiki and Fire Attack. So I probably wanna keep those, um, if I'm gonna use ranged units, I wanna be able to use those prana plants. So let's go to our squad. And I'm gonna clear this up and try to figure this out a little bit. So it's melee in front every time and every single time it's also um, a flying captain. So I'm gonna go ahead and change Bowser Jr. to ranged. And then in the front, we wanna have some flying units going on, I think. And if that's the case, Okay, never mind. I wish we had arranged first in line, like, you know, instead of, I'll put Morton there, I think, is gonna be a smarter idea. Maybe not, though, maybe not. Maybe this will be better. And then, because he could focus on that melee one, melee one. Well, actually, there is, there is one melee captain. I don't know how I noticed, didn't notice that. Well, that's where Kamek will be helpful. I can only hope. Uh, we'll probably use the sneak attack then, if we have the chance. And looking at everything else, once again, there's a front line of melee, so we wanna be able to do flying. If we can do three swoops, that's just a good combo to have. Well, no, what, yeah. I should be fine. Unless we wanna do like a combo of these guys. We'll have to sort of mix it up and sort of find out w which one's a good idea. So we can get some there. And then we have four more slots available. Every time it's usually a set of ranged troopers there. Okay. What if I did like Goomba? I wanna see if this is like a combo we can possibly do. Something like that, and then we'll have like one more slot left. Like is that something? That's not. That would've been cool if it was. Oh well. Hmm. So Goombas, and as you can see, that would take on the things. Huh. And then maybe in the back. Oh, there, there's so many decisions to make here. I guess we could try at least one. They're so low leveled compared to what we need, you know? We can try it still though. Something like that, and maybe make it move around the positioning so that at least benefits us in some way. Hopefully that combined with Bowser Jr. being ranged will help. I mean, not you. Wait, I don't need you. Wrong one. <laughs> Hold on, but you there. There we go, confirm that. We're gonna go to our items and see what beans we have. We had the melee experience bean M, which is very nice. I can use that for a couple of different units. Well, actually, where's Morton? I keep making really obvious mistakes here. We obviously want Morton. Okay. And then, confirm that, go to our items. We have this melee bean. I would like to use it with Morton, but these Goombas are pretty close to a level up as well. Let's go ahead and get this guy closer. I thought that's pretty good. Pow bean. I'll use that with Morton. And then a speed bean also use with Morton. And see how that goes. I mean, it seems the best to you know, the best I can get for now. I mean, maybe if we lose this, we can learn a little bit from it. Cause it is a level 17. I don't know what our team is. Stay focused. Oh, it's on the beach though. I mean, I get, that, that makes sense. I mean, we're, all, we're at a lake, I suppose. That's a lot of units. I'm a little worried this might not be powerful enough. Uh, here we go, you're gonna rally them. So I'm gonna rally two. I don't know how many rounds it is, three rounds. So we want to be a bit more conservative, but that's why next round, um, oh, don't deny those guys, come on. Got it, got it. Got the double accent, which is always nice to see. Enemy defense down as well. And and there's already one of them flying away. So it's nine to eight already. And Morton's not done, because he's the best ever. So that's nine to six. Keep going, guys. I'm not gonna deny that, just gotta leave it be. <laughs> Get it, B, leave it be. Yeah, we're doing fine, we're doing just fine. Keep going guys, keep going. Take him down. Oh, here we go, here we go. I timed that really badly. <laughs> Whoops. Come on, just beat this guy, he's the captain, and then we'll be good, there we go. We get some bonus experience for that one as well. Always good to see. I think we might actually be able to get Bowser Jr. level up this round, so that'll be nice. 
if we win, that is. So we'll have to be careful. But this is where we probably want to use that sneak attack. It's going to use all five of his CP. So we'll be able to find out how much uh, CP he gets back per between rounds. And boom. Yeah, not too much. But it's still something. It gives us a little bit of an advantage that we'll definitely need. Deny that. And I think that's all I want to do this round. But that could have been way worse. All four of them using a B is way worse than two of them using a B, you know? Okay. Got it? Got it. Now he's real low, so we should be able to get rid of him soon. Especially if we can do that. Oh my gosh, that was really good. Defense down. The swoops are so good. I gotta leave that B. I don't even know what these guys really do. Wow, they do that. Oh my gosh, that was insane. That was really insane. Can't let that happen again. But we're still at an advantage here. We're winning. Here we go. You guys are rallying, really? This actually could get real risky. No, they're doing something new. Oh, they're doing this combo, which honestly isn't too crazy against one swoop. I'm sorry for that swoop, but. All right, got it, and we got rid of that dude. So it's five to two. We should definitely still be able to win this. Come on, come on. We just gotta get rid of that Koopa. There goes the Koopa. Good job, Bowser Jr. Just was throwing that at him. And then, if these are melee, so the swoop should have an advantage here, and we'll combo up. Very good. See ya. Well, not enough to take you out, but definitely it lowered your defense, so that's gonna help. Come on, Swoop. You're the last one before it's me and Kamek, of course. Got it. Beautiful. So there's another victory. We're gonna keep moving forward with everybody. And lastly, we got this one. So this is where we can use a rally. We could even use two rallies if needed, but right now let's just do one. Come on, get fired up. All spirits are up. Very good. So with that, okay, now Morton's doing something. I like how he always goes for the flying units for whatever reason, whenever he uses his special, deny that. So he only got, uh, Kamek only got one CP back. Good to keep in mind. So there's no way he can re-earn up a sneak attack. It just won't happen. Rally? Oh boy. So deny that one as well. Maybe not actually worth it. Now that I think about it. I still have one more rally point though. It's eight to three, come on. They're shielding, apparently. Oh, great. That's fine, actually. We should be able to handle that. Okay, come on. Take care of this big green dude then, the Crawful. Come on. I guess it's a Crawful because it's a crocodile. Starts with CR. This power's up. It's giving me Morton flashbacks. Too bad we just lost Morton. He just flew away. Enemy defense up. Wow, you got him stacked up. I didn't get it stacked up like that. That's sort of a shame. Oh no, this is actually getting scary. It's still six to two, but come on, keep going. Oh, here we go. Nice, okay, so that some, did some good damage there. But still not enough to get rid of that Crawful. We need to keep eating them up. Deny it, there we go. I'll probably, that's our last deny, so. Oh, it looks like we might get rid of the captain before we get rid of him. We'll have to wait and see how this unfolds. I would really like it just to, come on, he's gotta be low. There it is, awesome. So now we'll get the bonus experience and he'll deny one of them, but the other one will still go. Yeah, if it was both of them, it would have definitely taken him out. And, oh, 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 if that got him. Oh boy, if that got him. Oh, Bowser Jr. just sneaks in the final hit. He's always gotta steal the glory, doesn't he? Well, there we go, another win for us. We're doing really well, I'm so happy about it. And we get a couple of extra units, so it's like a Co Co Red Koopa and Paratroopa. And level 17 for Bowser Jr. His CP increased by one, that is a miracle. Whenever we can get more CP, it's always good. And yeah, got a Red Koopa and a Red Paratroopa, which is new, but doesn't seem to have anything specific about it. Um, so there we go, we got that done. And now we just have one more battle left to worry about. It's Blubble Lake. Oh, is it Blubble? I thought it was Bubble. Blubble Lake broke Madame's handiwork. So if we take a look at the details here, it's just broke Madame. And she has smack back attack. A mysterious lady with an air of sophistication. Only some cold ice can soothe the aches that bother her. Okay. Um, so she is just a flying type. So if we go ahead and figure out our formation here. Um, dismiss all units except for Bowser Jr. We want everything to be ranged. Is what we want, I think. I mean, as far as I can tell. I mean, we might want to have Kamek with us as our first in line because, you know, at least that way he's not weak. 
against some um, Baroque. So yeah, we could try some interesting stuff here for sure if we have this much room to work with. Something like this, and then something like that. Hmm. Okay. And then I could do this. Nine out of nine. That doesn't give me any kind of cool benefit though, unfortunately. Which it would. Uh, then we'll just change it around. We'll do this, we'll do the hammer. Confirm. Okay, so let's give this a shot. And I think we'd be good. I think this should be very good. We'll, actually let's check our items real fast. We do have a flying bean, so I'll of course use that. Experience bean. Oh, five experience away from a level up, isn't that a shame? All right, well, that'll at least be a good advantage to have for uh, the next round. And then I'm also uh, a throwing, so we should be good. Begin! Let's hope this turns out well. So hopefully she'll be able to tell us what we need to know. Hi. Hello, Monsieur Kamek. Madam, it's been a while, hasn't it? Mas we. Mais we? I don't know what that word is. My, maybe my we? My we. Uh, but of course I am happy to see you, Sherry. What have you been up to? Same thing, you know, working for his, uh, his burliness, Lord Bowser. Ah, we. Oui. I have heard of this Lord Bowser, but I do not know him. And who are these um, amis of yours? We're trying to take to make a supplement, lady. Enough with the chit chat. Ooh, this one is a naughty boy. Tra oh, okay, I'm not gonna even bother trying to pronounce that one. So is this supplement you speak of? Yes, my friend is impatient, but it is true that time is of the essence. Toot toot, not so fast. Uh-oh. You see, I am having these aches and pains. I cannot relieve them by, by, by myself. I am needing the relief of a good strong massage. What's a massage? You have to be strong to do it? Then I can crush it. Ah wee, oui. this sounds promising. I need the powerful fists and the tender touch as well. You can do both? Let's hope. I can do anything. Hold my ever ice, Kamek. Very well. However, if you stop even for an instant, I will not have my relief. What does that mean? I don't know. We'll just have to constantly attack, I guess? <laughs> Her bed's gigantic. Stay focused. Let's go, formation hammer. Man, what to do about this? I don't entirely know. So we'll just go for it. <laughs> Should Kamek try a sneak attack? Oh no. Whoa, maybe I should've tried to deny that. Let's rally for now. What are you doing? Why are you beating us up? Come on, get fired up! This is a little scary, I gotta be honest. Okay, here we go. Throw it at you. Nice! <laughs> I mean, there's only one unit to throw it at, so it makes sense that we got it. She attacks quite often. Everybody start throwing. I don't know what to do with these guys. Oh, that was cool. Very nice, it was a critical as well. Eh, you must work the knots out. All right, then go for the sneak attack. Oh, you got the mystery block, da range damage? Oh, that's not fair, that was predetermined. That was random, that was in luck. This, will this even work? It does actually work, what do you know? <laughs> cool. Sakura Blue Eye will have these kids to take care of this. Call for backup, oh no. Oh, and they're melee. You sneaky rally up. Come on, guys. Come on, that stinks. Come on, get fired up. What I have to do is, like, they're not really attacking very much. All right, um, come on, come on, come on. That at least helps a little bit. We still have seven units here. Hopefully a little bit of this will attack her. It does, does not, come on you guys, come on. I didn't mean to do that. Oh well, it was critical, which is good. What are you doing now? I should have denied that wide the chance. Dang it, dang it again. Okay, ready for this? There it is, boom, it was okay damage. We're sort of in a bad spot here, you must work these knots out. I can't do that if you do whatever you're doing here. Why even attack me? Deny it! Denial failed? What the heck? What's the even point of denying it? Ah. Okay, giant turnip right at your back. 
Man, it's doing less and less damage the farther we go along, come on. This is getting really bad. Oh, and there goes Kamek as well. I don't know, we might have to refigure this out. Maybe that's why this world has been so easy, is so that we can be prepared for this tough thing. We got really close though. It's not close enough, now it's just me and, uh, me and her. Come on, come on. Let's hope we can do this. We do have the advantage technically, but then she can just do moves over and over again like this, and it hurts so much. Come on, come on. Oh, this is bad. Like we might be able to get, if we can get a special move here and not her, like, come on, please, please, no, really? That's just unlucky. Oh, no, I thought we had like a little sliver of health left. It was so close, though. Looks like Baroque Madame needs a stronger massage. Perhaps you could try adding an ice bar. I have three or two of your, or two for, to your formation. And remember, the Bowser Jr. snack time command can heal your troopers in a pinch. Um, last but not least, watch out for the whole bunch of melee troopers that show up late in the fight. It's a good idea to have some flying troopers in your formation just in case, which I think is what I'm gonna change now. Is that, honestly, I think we can switch up the shy guys. So what I might do here is first go to the formation and send these guys back here and then go and get some flying. If we want to do some good flying, I guess like these guys would be good. Oh, well, that's actually a red and a green one. I don't know if they'll combo then. Might just be smarter to do this instead. But then that's not a level 17. Like That's a level 17 combo, but I'd rather have the proper combos like this. So we'll try this, hope it works. I don't have any items to work with, so this is my best bet. Let's try it again. This is tough though, this is really difficult. Come on now. Are you guys ready? Stay focused. I sure hope so. Let's go Formation H. And maybe Formation H will be a little bit better. I forget what it does. So I can't deny that, so don't bother. Yikes. But when we need it, we need to do snack time. And then we can just do sneak attack immediately. Like, it doesn't really matter when we do it. Got it. And like, I can do one rally, but then after that I need to save all the CP for the snack time. So let's go ahead and just get a rally out now so when it can be fully focused on Madame Baroque. So can one of you just do some good attacks? They're all sort of just standing there right now. Criticals, there we go. Oh, come on, really? Before I could even, like, before any of like, nobody's doing anything. <laughs> oh my gosh. More than me reinforcements showed up. I know, I know, I've noticed. Is nobody gonna do a combo move? Nobody at all? Come on. I did my rally and just nothing happened and then this is rigged range damage. All right, we missed somebody. Okay, finally. Of course, it's Kamek doing something against a bug. You know, it's just like, oh, come on, where are the swoops? Where are these guys? I, oh, why'd I do that? I didn't, I shouldn't have done that. Okay, come on. Go for it, go for it, go for it. That's at least a lot better. You know, if we need to, we'll just have to rally again. Cause she's rallying. Get rid of this stinking bug. Come on, there it is. We can't deny that. So, you know, now's my chance to just rally again. Get everybody's spirits back up. We might just be able to brute force this one without the snack time. Why does it have to hit Kamek every time? Poor Kamek. Can somebody get something here? Come on, just use a combo move, please, please. Ice bros, oh, of course. Well, at least you wasted her deny against one unit instead of it being multiples. Come on, no, I need that ice bro. Darn it. Come on, it's so close. Yes, we got it, awesome. I can't believe we got that there. That was very good. Okay, so you have been massaged. She seemed to have liked that. Goodbye. Victory! And what else is going on? Oh, that's it. Cleared! Awesome. <laughs> okay, then. Ooh la la. That was very nice. It is getting tres hot in here, no? Lady, can you just hurry up and make my skeleton? Boy, you must learn there is no beauty in rushing. The best things are worth waiting for, no? Now give a lady her space, s'il vous play. All right, have fun. How long do we have to wait? Let me see, first the mise in place. Carefully, we mince the carrot and the onion. Oh my, uh-oh. Don't tell me she burn all of it. Now, we simmer them gently, gently. It doesn't sound very gentle. 
I don't think she has a good understanding of what's gentle either way. Why didn't anyone tell me Cookie was this exciting? It's news to me. A light touch with a zitenderizer. Kicking it, kicking it, cooking in the kitchen. It's very exciting. And if you know what you're doing. Uh, there's nothing light about this. I can trust her, she knows what she's doing. Now a sprinkle of the ever ice. Oh my. Ah, ah, not too much. Toot, toot. This is the most delicate part. <laughs> Earthquake. And here we have, la voila. Did it work? Wait, is she speaking to uh, speaking another language? <laughs> Oi, monsieur. She he just pieced it together. Sis Bonds, there we are. About time. Resort to laws, it is ready. I have made a large batch pour vous. Oh, pour vous. There should be plenty, even for the hungry garçon. Ooh, nice. You got 200 servings of Skeleton Formula D. 200 is a lot. So hopefully that heals up the entire Bowser minion army. And there we go, tons of experience, but none for Bowser Jr. We get the Super Bean S, and then also the range experience being M. Not too bad then, I like it. And what's going on now? Cool, we got the stuff. Now let's hurry up and get back to the castle. Dad's gonna be so impressed. Yes, assuming he has found his way back. Hello, pardon me. Oh no, wait, hey, watch where you're flying. Oh no, she just stole all of it, didn't she? Let's see what you've got here. What is that? Oh yes, encapsulated and everything, well done. Well, maybe that's it. Yeah, I totally made that, impressive, right? Oh no. Kaylee, behold. Show me. That isn't going to cure the minions, is it? I have obtained the most toxic creature in this kingdom, Molod Molodora's Fibian. Yes, this simple frog is one million times more toxic than a poison mushroom. Ooh, I'm toxin invigorated. Keep talking toxins. Actually, there's no time for that. Let's proceed straight to Operation Smoothie. I've got Skeleton Formula D. You've got Molodorius Fibian. Oh no, what's happening? Why are we just watching this happen? Hey, what are you doing to my skeleton? I don't know, I didn't show dad yet. <laughs> Even, it is already done. We've supplemented the supplement. I give you, I give you, Malatone Formula X. No, why'd you do that? Now how am I supposed to impress dad? Oh, you're still here, how unfortunate for you. Dieter, I am thinking we dispose of this problem now-ish. Yes, I have a fun and scientific idea. Oh no, why more? No, our only friend left. What was that for? Look, Morton's just big bones. He doesn't have the blorbs. Oh wait, you put that poison stuff in there. Did you just poison Morton? Answer me. Mmm, sweet. Yummy, in Morton tummy. <laughs> Poor Morton. Look at that, his met metabolism is rising. Morton, you're kinda glowing and uh, on fire. I don't like this, I thought it was Morton. I don't like this, Morton is my buddy. Ah, Lord Junior, run now. This melatonin is even more powerful than I imagined. Watch as it invigorates every muscle cell in his body and simultaneously shuts down every brain cell. That's right, all 10 of them. And now he is fit to do our bidding. Super strong, super violent, a new best fitness friend. Lord Junior. Oh no. Ooh, look at that, it's a beautiful painting. And we're done here. Go ahead, Morton, destroy them. Morton, stop this instant. He's not attacking, I guess we'll need to do this ourselves. Uh, wait a second, where's Beef? Oh, he said he was staying back to guard the castle. And I said, yeah, sure, take a load off and relax, big guy, because even with only two of us, defeating these wimps will be 
a piece of gluten-free cake. Hey, weirdo, don't you know who I am? Nothing is easy without me, nothing. Oh, no. Ow. <laughs> Young master. No, leave him alone. This is really bad. Teehee. Oh, that was hilarious. Just when he said it wouldn't be easy, it was so easy. Chalk up another win for the best fitness friends. Yeah, and we didn't even have to lift any of our perfectly toned fingers. Now, Brute Morton, dispose of this tiny but surprisingly annoying creature. Oh no, poor Bowser Jr., his buddy. Young master. Wait, what? Who said that? Was that Kamek? Where was Kamek? That was not, I mean, maybe that was Morton, but I don't think so. I just, like, Kamek was his off screen or something. I didn't see him there. Well, Bowser's under the water now. Yikes. Can he even swim, the poor guy? Bye bye! <laughs> we are so naughty. And now that we have a Melatone Formula X, even Lord Fawful. No, what am I saying? Even loser Fawful doesn't stand a chance. So these guys are even af after Lord Fawful. Wow. The Koopalings were scattered, the kingdom in disarray. Blorb Dominions littered the landscape like oversized novelty balloons, and Lord Bowser Jr. was defeated. These were some of the toughest times the minions had ever faced. Yet despite the staggering odds, I never lost faith. I knew that Lord Jr. and Lord Bowser would pull us through somehow. And he's been all washed up. Ah, uh, my head. Aha, there you are. Who's this comic again? It is. Thank goodness you're all right. Kamek, what happened? Where are we? Well, I'm not sure. Some sort of beach, obviously. Those fitness monsters knocked us out and threw, and, and threw us into sea. With the help of Malatone ad adult Morton, sadly, we must have washed ashore here. Wait, you're saying I lost a fight? Very badly and against your only buddy. <laughs> they got lucky, I want a rematch. Let's go find them right now, this is gonna be a blowout. That's not a good idea. You're not wrong, but it will be you who is blown out. What did you just say to me? Choose your next words carefully. Young master, with all due respect, you simply cannot beat them by yourself. Says you. Let me ask you this, do you think Lord Bowser could defeat that group? Well, yeah, of course he could. Dad's the strongest and best at everything. Lord Bowser's mighty, there's no question. However, his real power lies with the minions. Those clowns, come on. Think about it, the minions adore Lord Bowser. If he so wished, they would jump through fire or into the deepest ocean. Now, what do you think inspires that devotion? They simply fear him? No, it's much more powerful than that. Only love and admiration can inspire such loyalty. People adore me? Young master, look around. Do you see any friends? How about the Koopalings? Oh no, he's getting it. Um. He's finally pieced it together. The Koopalings and the Minions are your allies. You should consider treating them with respect. Think back as far as you can. Have you ever done so? I don't think he has. Kamek. Yes, young master? I'm starving. Oh, maybe he doesn't. Are you serious? Yes, yes, of course you're serious. Very well, I'll go find you something to eat. <laughs> that was just to get him away so he can have some thinking time. Maybe not. What is he doing? Oh, he's got Morton's little food. Is he gonna eat it? Oh, that's sort of nice. 
I mean, even if it was gross. Don't worry about me, I can find the ingredients myself. I didn't want your help anyway. Lord Junior, I know you're in charge, but not even your dad talks to us like that. Maybe these are some flashbacks. Come on, Wendy, it's not worth it. Let's hurry back to the castle. The kid says he doesn't need us, let's let him prove it. Bah, grow a spine, Larry. He only cares about himself. He'll never appreciate or respect us, I'm over it. Work it out, kid. Grr, who needs you anyway? Bah, that was way too easy. I'm too strong for my own good, it's my princely curse. Right, that's definitely a factor. But didn't it also help that Morn stepped in to protect you? <laughs> yeah, right, Morn just got in the way. He's such a glory stealer. Oh, Morton, sorry. Maybe he's finally seeing the errors in his ways. Ah. And then there was Morton. Lord Junior. Ah. Oh man. Oh, he's crying. I feel bad now. Morton, give food. Eat, eat now. Is that a drumstick? Give me, give me. Wait a second. Where have you been keeping that thing? Ah, oh, who cares? Food is food. And now he's finally gonna eat it. Maybe. Hold on. This is all burnt. What'd you do to it? Morton cook with fire. Morton strong, but fire more strong. He cooked it himself. Okay, big guy, I'll uh, eat it later. And here we are back again. So lots of cutscenes in this episode to make up for the lack of battling. I'm sorry, I didn't find anything. There's only sea and sand for miles. Unless you think hermit crabs are edible. Young master, oh. Oh, he's eating it. My tears are the perfect seasoning. Weird. Oh, that's so sad. Is he just gonna walk away? He's like, okay, I don't need to see this. It really is too burnt, stupid Morton. <laughs> I think he's learned his ways even if he has a hard time showing it. We're saving the the game now, and it looks like we are now on whatever beach this is. It is Plaque Beach, okay, very cool. Oh, and there's an Iggy you can see in there. So we definitely have to get to doing that, saving Iggy. I guess he fell off the cliff and landed on Plaque Beach as well, that'll be super duper cool. We'll be exploring that in the next episode of Bowser Jr.'s Journey. If you watched this part of the video, make sure you comment Zebra Morton, so any of you've watched the end, you are a Zebra-tastic viewer. Check out more episodes like this one on your screen right now, or by subscribing to join the Zebra Herd. Out of the way, thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you next time, bye bye.